Hello, Cancer. Welcome. I'm Ryan. Thank you for being here. This is going to be a general reading, so everything may not resonate. Take what does and leave the rest. And for more tarot readings after this, please check out my wife's channel. We've got the D3 Tarot, which is review as well. Thank you. see what's going on. Okay. Well, that's a nice start, Can. So that's a really nice start. What's going on with this? Um, I'll just jump into this right away because I like how this is starting off on a high note. Um, there's a lot of happiness and fulfillment here. Right out the gate, there's a lot of happiness and fulfillment. I don't know exactly if this is regarding something you've started recently, currently, um, regarding a project, plan, endeavor, financial pursuit, what this is, or possibly even a living situation or maybe a new living situation. Um, there's a lot, and I mean a lot of nice energy here. Not only is there some sort of new beginning of some sort, or maybe the start of some sort of project, I don't exactly know quite yet. Um, but whatever this energy is, you're feeling good, you're feeling inspired, you're feeling creative. There's also a lot of positive times here. You're also kind of recalling and remembering and bringing up. And I'm not, to, I'm not gonna say this is regarding some sort of comparison. Um, but it seems it feels like you're just working with the circumstances and the newness of the circumstances to kind of make change and move forward. And what's nice here is very, very quickly and very rapidly, something is actually working out for you and benefiting you financially wise. You are getting some sort of recognition for something here that you've changed, you kind of switched around. And not only that, once again, there's a, again, this, em, this energy emphasized of happiness and fulfillment and getting what you want. Like I said, it's just a very nice energy right away. Something's clearly working out. Hmm. Interesting. What's that about, though? responsibility lots of responsibility you're kind of like saying yeah it's great everything is like awesome to begin with but you're also kind of saying like it, it's like um a small win for a much larger difficulty so much responsibility you gotta take care of here that it seems and feels like it's a very small piece of the bigger picture you're having to take care of everything you possibly can but immediately you're kind of like saying I need a moment or I need a break for me and I need it fast. Um, you're kind of like, that's great. That's great. Everything works out for me. Now I need a vacation. Um, I'm out. It's like, okay. Very quickly though, I kind of feel like what you're saying is I need to get my mind right. I need, I need to kind of get myself energetically back on track with things in order to continue moving forward. It, it's almost kind of like you're saying like time out. Um, okay, give it some time. You're taking some time. Things are progressing and moving forward. And because of that, I feel as if you energetically are changing here and you're saying, I just want to move forward. I want to move on. So you're moving on. Now, that being said, though, unfortunately, there is something here that is very difficult you are working with and working through. I don't exactly know what that is yet. Um, but there definitely has been some difficulties, to say the least. At the same time, you're, you're definitely well aware of like what this all is about, what all this means, how this kind of, in a sense, plays its part or plays its role in the bigger picture of things. So, hmm. Okay, a little bit interesting here. What's this about? Hmm. 
Yeah, that's what I was kind of wondering. There it is. There's definitely been some sort of financial losses or difficulties along the way. What you're saying is, even though something works out for you and that's great and all, but having to move forward with this endeavor, this pursuit, means also leaving certain things behind. Whether it be locations, whether it be investments, whether it be plans or ideas or some sort. Um, you're making a boss decision right now. You're ultimately saying, with everything I've got going on, with everything I've got to be responsible for and, and take care of, as well as upkeep and maintain, you're strongly feeling like the best option or choice for you is to possibly make someone an offer, or maybe someone's making you an offer. It feels like you're making someone an offer, though, um, because there is this collaborative energy here between you and someone in order to kind of keep things going, in a sense, to keep the ball rolling. You're showing me that regarding everything that's going on, like I said with that energy about the, I need a pause, I need a break, I need a vacation, like now, you're still showing me that same energy. So even though you are collaborating with someone on this and kind of like dealing with something as a team, um, energetically speaking, you're kind of like saying, yes, I am taking care of everything I possibly can. At the same time, it's like, okay, and now breathe and now continue. Repetition, this is all about cycle and repetition. Um, you still strongly believe that things will kind of work out and turn out in your favor, but I don't exactly know what's going on because it seems like even though the two of you are trying to confront and deal with this together, there's still something, how do I say this? There's still something energetically missing that's playing a key role in this situation. You're not too sure exactly what is going on here. I feel like for some reason it's like, yeah, you're trying to make the best of it. That's why. I'm trying to make the best of it. Okay. Interesting. I believe I recall this energy. Yeah, I believe I recall this energy yesterday with actually a couple of the signs and who they were dealing with. Um, interesting. So it's kind of like, and there it is. Um, a lot of what you're saying is regarding this collaborative energy between you and them, I do feel like this is a difficult dynamic or situation between the two of you, romantically speaking. You show me that this is about business. And then though, you're showing me that whatever this difficulty is that's taking its toll on you regarding money, finances, investments, and business, um, I feel like you're doing absolutely everything you can to kind of like make the best of the situation and the unfortunate circumstances because money is actually so tight and difficult right now that it's like you're you're in this you're between a rock and a hard place in other words you do understand that it's like you are trying to make the best of the situation because of the finances but at the same time because there is a relationship commitment or marriage in place that does somehow offer you some sort of public recognition um, that's what's actually breaking your heart is the realization as to what's going on regarding the situations and the dynamic between the two of you. You're ultimately saying, even though, yes, you do get some sort of publicity or recognition from this connection between the two of you, you're even kind of like, I need a moment with myself again to figure out like what's going on with me internally. So there's, there's clearly a lot to kind of think about and a lot to process as well as sort through when it comes to I don't know, priorities or whatever it is that you're working through emotionally speaking because you're showing me that you're in it, you're going through it, but you're not exactly kind of showing me where you're trying to get to. And that's where I'm kind of like, okay, I understand that, you know, life is best lived and learned. Um, just don't know where you're going. You're showing me, it's like, I'm in this and I'm going through it, but I'm going through the ringer and I just don't know what I'm going through this. And it's like, okay, that's, that's definitely life. Um, Welcome. Of course, if you are dealing with anyone, you could be dealing with an earth sign, a fire sign, an air sign. Hmm. And that is all.